Hi everyone, it's me. Uh, so hopefully this video turns out okay. This is the first time I've actually gone to YouTube and selected uh, record a video. So we're going to try this and hope it turns out okay. Um, don't mind the look. I'm looking very gorgeous. It's 9 o'clock at night. Whatever. But it's bright. Oh look, random light switch. Ah, nice. Okay, so this video is my November favorites. I don't have any poos or fudge roos or whatever you want to call them. So, that's a first, I think. Um, these are all either makeup related or I do have a few baby things in there as well because lots of us are moms. So, we will start with the beauty makeup type things. Uh, the first thing I liked, and I got this a while, a while, like a long time ago, back in a Beauty Army box. I don't even get Beauty Army anymore. Um, and it is, uh, it's called Psst Instant Dry Shampoo. That is what it looks like. And it was one of the, you know, the salt samples or whatever, obviously. Um, I finally used it, and it's gone. I think there might be just a smidge left. Um, this is so far the only dry shampoo. I don't use it a lot. I haven't, obviously, I've had this for quite some time. Um, but when I do, like I've tried a couple different kinds. This one is the only kind that when you spray it and you leave it in your hair for a little bit and then you kind of run it through or whatever. It's the only one that you don't get where it looks like you've got like, oh I've got nice and roots. Look at that. Um, I don't have no money. Anyway, um, this is the only one that when you put it in even after you brush out, it does not look like somebody has dumped baby powder on your head. Some of them I've tried, you still get that white powdery dandruffy looking e, and it leaves your hair soft. I like that. It smells fresh and clean. So, that is an awesome one. The next one I have is, again, hair, and this came in a sample of uh, one of my boxes, and I want to say it's birch box because that's the only one that I'm really still doing and this seems to me like something I got rather recently. This is by Liquid. This is the Perfect Wave Beach Hair. Uh, beach Hair without the crunch. Um, I will try and remember to on my blog post my favorites and then I will post a picture of how my hair looked um, when I did do it. As you can see right now it's rather straight. Not straight but it's not like really wavy or anything. This is just my normal I don't do anything with my hair. This is what my hair does. It's rather bleh. It's kind of frizzy. I have lots of like um, growth, new growth going on right now, so it's very frizzy. I don't know what to do with this. But anyways, this worked well. It did do what it says. It didn't leave crunch. It doesn't smell like much of anything. It just you know smells like hair gel or whatever. Um, you just rub dive size dollop of product between your palms and spread and scrunch and in sections. Um, now the way I did it was I only did, you know, and then I kind of did this through my hair. It does say that when you do it you can use a diffuser. You can air dry or diffuse. And then when it's dry to separate with fingers and tussle. So I did that. It did give me the kind of beachy, wavy, like I just came out, well I've never been to a beach, but that look, you know, wet but not greasy, goopy, I keep looking down here because I have the camera. <laughs> I keep looking at myself on the screen. I need to put something there to block myself. Um, but it does do what it says, and I like that. I did not get on to see how much it is, but it is by, like I said, Liquid and the Perfect Wave. So, yay for that. Uh, the next item is... How did I get this? I think I signed up on Facebook and they sent me this and also came with a coupon. It is from Burt's Bees called Good Natural Body Lotion. Another little sample and it is in the smell Vanilla Flame. Vanilla and rice milk is this. I like this. This smells super good and a little goes a long way. I actually, I don't think you can tell if I hold it. I still have some so it's still kind of fat there. Um, I like it. It doesn't leave your hands feeling waxy. It doesn't leave your hands feeling like like either you don't have any or you have too much and it's just like slippery dewy. Um, and it smells good and the smell lasts quite a while. So this I like. The next item, this came in a sample box as well, probably Birchbox. 
and this is by The Balm Cosmetics, and it is the Mary Lou, M Mary Luminizer, aka The Luminizer. Um, it's highlighter, shimmer, eyeshadow, and here's a little box that came in. And hold on. Oh, it's a little focus. I don't think this thing has autofocus. Um, but that is what it looks like. It's a little bit goes an absolute long way. You just can, you know, even if I just do this, you can, you can tell right away. Um, I used it as a highlight. It's the first time I've actually done really a highlight with a highlight. And I will say it worked really well. I really liked that effect. Um, I think I will probably try it again maybe as an eyelid, eyeshadow or maybe as you know for your brow or whatever um, but I'm definitely liking this. This is the only product I have from the balm and mm, I like it. So two more beauty type things um, and these are both samples that I have from Sephora. Uh, so the first one I have is Tarte uh, primer. I think it was from Tarte. Um, it's a little bit in there. I'm not sure if you can tell. Um, I have used this once. I may try it again. I'm not really big into primers. I don't really notice much of a difference, but I will try it again only for the simple fact of the foundation that I use right now currently is Physicians Formula. It's you know drugstore brand. Um, but I do have heart coming in mail. I finally ordered it from QVC. So I think if I pair this with their actual foundation, I'll be able to test it better. But with cheaper foundation, I don't think I really noticed much of a difference. It didn't stop it from settling or anything like that because that, to me, Physicians Formula Foundation just seemed to wear out quickly anyway. So it wasn't really something that was going to be long standing to prevent any issues. Um, but Alright, but the other thing is from Tarte, this is the Tinted Moisturizer in Agent 4. I liked this. I'm beginning to decide that I love Tarte. Um, so here's, I still have a little bit left in there. I liked it because it, you know, it's just a tinted moisturizer, but it is buildable. So I was able, you could, you know, put a second layer on if you wanted more coverage. Because I do have, uh, I can see here, a little H spot and freckles and whatever. So. Uh, you can build this, so I like that. Like I said, that's the Tarte Tinted Moisturizer in Agent 4. Um, so that is it for beauty related. And now we will move on to the mommy and baby type stuff. Uh, the first thing we are really liking right now, my daughter is... Oh my god. She is going to be 15 months in like two days. She is loving, and I say this because I know this, this is Baby Aura Gel's Tooth and Gum Cleanser. And it is, does it have a flavor? Fluoride free. Let's smell it. it smells sweet. It's probably berry flavored or something. Um, for cleaner teeth and gums. She has two and a half teeth. One just kind of sprouted on top. But it's got this little brush thingy that you put on, so you know, you dab it on there, and then you can get in there and kind of. She thinks this is hilarious, and she loves it. And then all I have to do is get this out, and she comes running to brush her teeth. So hopefully, we're setting a good um, oral hygiene, you know, foundation for her because she is absolutely loving it. She loves it on the gum for the sweet. So, baby oral gel tooth and gum cleanser, safe as swallowed, fluoride free. Yeah, it doesn't say if it's a flavor or anything, but that is it. The next thing, these are both for babies, kids, it's more of a mommy favorite. <laughs> the first one is Wiggy Wipes. These are gentle saline wipes for stuffy noses, made with natural saline. I got these because everybody was raving about them, and then if you have a daughter or a child in general, you know when they're, until they're a certain age, they just can't seem to wipe their nose, blow their nose, and it's just always bleh, if they've got a cold or something. This is awesome because you don't have to try and track, pin them down to spray saline up their nose to dry it out or anything. You wipe this up, their, you know, wipe their nose off with this. They think it's fun. Um, this is a fresh scent. It's fresh to me. 
Um, and this huge package. We bought a big giant package from uh, Sam's Club, so we have little packets that go in the diaper bag, and then we've got the big ones here. I think we have grape scented ones as well, but we haven't used them yet. Just these. So, boogie wipes. Awesome. And the last thing is, these are from Munchkin. We picked them up at Target. Set of two of them for I think six bucks or something like that. Um, they're called Snack Catcher Snack Dispensers. Now, I have one open here because this is what she's been using. Um, so they got the little handles on it. Kind of looks like a cup until you flip it up and it's got the little silicone opening. So she can, you can put treats in there and she can reach in, get her little puffs out or whatever. And she's not going to spill it anywhere. To fill it, it easily just pops right off. So as she gets older, if you don't need to, you can you know, get rid of these or whatever. Um, when she first started using it, <laughs> which um, she would stick her hand in there, play with whatever was in there, but wouldn't grab it to pull it out. So then she was getting mad. Took a quite a few shows, and then she finally figured out she could do that. Um, so she's loving this because now she can run around with snacks in the house. Whereas before, we'd always come out to the kitchen and do snack time. And this is perfect for in the car. You just have you know, your materials in there, hand it back to her. She can be snacking on it with her spill proof sippy cup. And she's got a great old snack time going on. So, definitely, definitely, definitely recommend you pick them up. You can pick them up at Walmart or wherever. Um, but we got them at tar Target. That's where my husband works, so we get a discount. So, we love Target. You should too. Go shopping there. I can be able to buy more things because it'll keep my husband in business. He works in the distribution center, or in a distribution center. So, I am pretty sure that is it for my November favorites. Um, if you have any questions or comments, post them below. Um, I will try and do my blog as soon as possible, and I will link what that is down below as well. I don't do get on there a lot, but I'm going to try and do better at that. Um, again, any questions, concerns, any recommendations or requests for videos you'd like to see, post that down below. Um, I will try and run the list of what all my favorites were down below as well. Um, you can link your video for yours as a video response to this if you'd want. Um, and we will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.